Hey guys, no one left behind, back again for stage four of Babylon's, Babylon Rising walkthrough. Um, this time around, we'll, the goal uh, is to survive for eight minutes. Uh, they're going to throw a whole bunch of things at you. Uh, you've gotten a different power. Um, you can choose which one you want back and forth. Uh, I did it backwards, not even thinking about it. But uh, the water ability, the primary function of it is to slow down enemies. In fact, I'm pretty sure you don't do any damage to them whatsoever uh, while the rain is affecting them. <clears throat> However, the secondary free stops enemies in their tracks, and as you can see, it freezes them and then they die. This one's not too difficult, I don't believe, but I think as you progress, they're going to start throwing more and more enemies at you. We'll see when we get there. Um, the best thing about the water ability, uh, besides the fact that it helps in you know pop crowd control, slows them down and puts them all together, which then you can use the rift like I just did there, uh, gather them all up and then hit them at once. Uh, that's really effective, but the, the really cool thing about it is the final ability. Uh, it floods the surface of the land up to about just over the second level of your tower. And in this one, you can't really see, I'm not scrolling around, but they've, the, the beginning of the level, you've already kind of gotten there. Well, they've put you around to the second level. So they give the enemies a head start, and they do that more and more as the game progresses. It's kind of a pain in the ass near the final levels. But uh, as you see here, we're just keeping them at the entrance, um, putting that cloud up, really just, I mean, I got nothing to do. One thing I want you to really notice though is I've kept this combo going. Uh, I just hit the times 30 and the rain, it it's like a constant hit. It's constantly hitting the enemy even though it's not doing damage. So it can help you can use that to your advantage to like recharge some of your other abilities if you're in a tight situation. Um, and just keep it going. I mean 34 times 9,160. That's quite a total right there. Uh, just over, what, 300,000, 30,000? Yeah. So, just keep it going. Try not to run out of enemies. Use that rain cloud. It really helps. That's about it. I mean, not really much else to it. There's not any special enemies. I think they might throw a couple priests at you here around three minutes, two minutes left. I'll pop back in if I need to describe anything. Um, let the track play. Put on a little music. Enjoy, guys.
Ah, ah, there we used the final ability for the water. See how it uh, took out everything up to a certain point. Later on, uh, people are going to survive that attack, but if you can keep them all pretty much near the entrance, it's going to be your best bet for eliminating everybody on the battlefield. And when they're coming from both sides, that's really an advantage when you kind of get behind. it up. Uh, this one's in the bag with 10 seconds left to go. Uh, stay tuned. We'll be back with stage five. It's going to be a little more difficult. There's no one left behind. Signing out.